okay guys so in this very short tutorial i'm going to talk about how to use a vpn app called open tunnel it's a manual configuration vpn app you don't have to be selecting anything but you have to rather make settings and connect or you get settings from someone and you connect in order to use the open tunnel app for your free internet access you first have to go to the play store and yeah you go and search for the name of the application open tunnel well now you will search for open tunnel i think it will be the first to come and every they will be adding some other but just look inside and make sure the icon of the application has something like a syringe or is it a rocket on it yeah so this is this is the icon this is the application icon for open tunnel uh, it's like either a syringe or a rocket i don't know so for me i've already installed it so if you set open tunnel make sure you get this one by rooster kit and tap on install now when you install the application and open it you see that the application is blank and when you try to connect it by pressing on this start button you get a choice down there that set correctly to start if i try start it says set correctly to start so you have to get SSH host port, username, password, local port, and some other host settings. It'll be with this one. Say invalid proxy, whichever one that you choose, you need to configure it. So let's say that we don't know how to configure this application. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get someone's configuration from either sector um, from either telegram or whatsapp or any other platform or even the person can send to you on sender bluetooth or any other so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to first try with um telegram Okay, so I have one um, Telegram channel here called AppLinking channel. I'm not the owner of this channel. I also have some channels, but then for some reasons I've been busy a little, so I've stopped posting files over there. So in this channel, you can search in Telegram AppLinking channel or VPN app, uh, VPN files, or any other that you get, or VPN app for Ghana, something like that. Then you press on it. You are going to see some files like this posted over there. And you can see we have a MTN 500MB open, t t open channel dot tn. So I'm going to click on this one and then select open channel app and then press just once. Make sure you press just once because you will not be using only open channel for this. Sometimes you may be using a different application, so you have to import it to that application. If you use open the just ones, you get a problem there. So once the application imports, successfully imports the file, then you press on the start. And once you press the start and you get password authenticated, connected, then that's it. You can just go everywhere and search for anything that you want and in fact you are browsing absolutely free as you, as you saw it there was a 500 megabyte tag on it most of the times the um the bundle is either 700 megabytes 1.2 gig or 100 uh, 1 gig or 700 600 megabytes depending on how the file creator did it so all right so basically this is how we can get free internet with this open tunnel app is you press on start and there is no need you you won't be watching any advert you won't have to be adding any time nothing you just connect and use it the whole day 
maybe some files can even last up to a month a week or something sometimes you have to be updating the files you have to go to the where you downloaded it and download a new one assuming um, you are using this telegram you are using telegram but then you don't want to um, for some reason when you click on the on the file you don't see the application open tunnel application in the list that you'll be provided to use to install it um, to import you can just um, tap on the dots over here and go to save to download now that it is saved to download you open your open tunnel application then you go to this icon you go to import config and with the import configuration you go to download and select the file that i just i recently downloaded which is this one and you can see the same configuration was successfully imported and i will press the start to start with a connection yes so it is connected and i can use the internet for free i'm going to stop it again and i'm going to talk of how to import configuration files on whatsapp as well so what i'll do is yeah again um yeah again i'm going to clear it so that it looks like it is newly downloaded uh installed then i'll launch my whatsapp when i launch my whatsapp i have a lot of vpn files um, groups that i'm on it some of them are my my own like this one i think i i, I posted this on friday so i'm going to if you can see we have a dot tnl over here i'll be leaving the link to um some of these um charts, some of these groups on down the description box so um, those of you who want to join so that you can be getting fast on whatsapp can do that else then you have to go to telegram so you tap on it and it you can see we have a, i have a lot of vpn applications on my device so i'll search for open tunnel and import config over there and if there is an option to select just once you do it as search so I import it you go to start and you can see we just connected we had password authenticated and connected so this is that uh, we can browse freely you can browse anything you want you can watch videos chat and it's not only my um, my group that you can be getting files there are a lot of groups so I'll be leaving the link in the description uh, yeah i'll be doing so yeah i think this is called tech gh vpn tutorial and this um this guy to also post these files in his group and i'll try and give a link um to provide links to these chats or uh, channel um whatsapp groups in the description so whenever you see a .cnl, it means the file is for open tunnel so i will be I, I can download any of them then go to import with config make sure you use the just ones because sometimes you you may not be using the open tunnel you will be using a different application okay then you, you tap on start and you wait you patiently wait for the connection to exam and you can see password authenticated and connected that's all and so this is how you can be using free internet on your android application this is one way of doing it there are different ways many many different ways to browse the internet for free especially even these vpn applications there are so many of them and we have different types each one and its own configuration all right guys so this is the end of this tutorial and if you have any question constructive criticism ideas make sure you put them down in the comment section and if you like this video give it a thumbs up and let me say if this is the first time you are watching a video tutorial on this youtube channel consider subscribing because we are here to drop more and more tech tips and tricks for con 
concerning free internet and you are not going to miss an update anytime you post a video you'll be notified and see you in the next video and until then goodbye